All right. Hey, right it's pre-show time. Hey, pre-show. What's up, guys? Yeah. yeah. What's this? Another guest host? Oh, what matters? God. I forgot that was in there. <laughs> <laughs> You'll see it in a second. It's that, that, that. Money. Yeah, well, no, not a second. 30 seconds. Oh, well, yeah. Uh, yeah. That delay. I... I've got this thing marked images to display and it's unchecked and I checked it and boom, Morty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Morty? Just, oh, God. I just saw it, that yeah. picture. <laughs> uh, let's remove uh, that. Actually, no, let's not remove it because I'm going to use it for any other images I want to pull up. Yay, okay. All right. So, mm. hey. Yeah, Steel is here. You are correct, Rock and Brony. Yes, last minute entry. Yeah, <laughs> totally didn't have last minute. It was a last minute because everybody else is busy and Tim's watching. Talk about debate, last minute so. entry. I joined the call. I'm streaming. I joined the call. You guys were already talking. Like, are we gonna do a show today? What? The <laughs> <laughs> Makes me wonder if we do a show every time. But then when we're up, I'm like, oh God, what do we have to do? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I, I, I watched the recording. I still have to handbrake it, but I watched the recording from last week and surprisingly not as awful as I remembered. Yeah, no, we did. Wait, Rock and Brony said he would have joined. <laughs> well, we still have 18 minutes. Is he... We still have 18 minutes. Does... Would you like to join us, Rock yeah. and Brony? Well, do we have. Can I jam? Let's see. Besides, I need to talk to you later um... on anyway. Ooh. It's not that, that kind of thing. Oh, Get your mind out of the gutter. Uh, no, no, PG, PG. Slip PG that under the doorway. Whatever the rating yes. is at this point. Um, <laughs> Dice, do you hey, have the ability the to ratings. add people to the call? I am working on that. Oh, rock and roll, because I do not have the ability to add uh, Rock and Brody, because he's not in my contacts. Uh, well, I, I do it because he's in my contacts. Because yeah, but I'm do you have the ability to add people to this yes. call? Yes, I do, because I'm cool. <laughs> okay, first of all, well, I beg thanks. to differ. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay, <laughs> you know what? We're going to be like that. And blue. Done it. Wait, if he's not in my... um. Okay. <laughs> I am confused, because like, if he is not in my contacts... Then, uh, why is that very familiar looking? Like, I have his profile. I've seen him in calls before. With his profile pic. It's not a question mark or anything. And he's not connecting. He said he's connecting. Mm, might, might still be... Um, up, actually... Like, might still be booting Skype up. <laughs> it, it may be failing to connect because, um... All right, I'm going to uh, I'm going to do a thing here. I'm going to switch over to the logo. We're still on. We're just not visible. Uh, that way, I can go through and see if he's even in my contact list. Hey, he not... says he says you can call him now. Then you can call him. So I call him. All right. Oh yeah, he is. He is in my. Uh, he's in my contact list. Okay, what the heck? <laughs> Welcome to. I don't know. I don't know. Do this. <laughs> oh, there he is. And see, this is what paying attention will get you. Boop. Paying attention. Boom! There he that? is. Okay. I'm back. You are back, hey. and you are now hey. visible in our. Oh, good lord, I have to fix that. <laughs> yeah, I just saw your message, uh, Snowblitz. Yeah. We'll, t we'll talk about that later. <laughs> <laughs> Move that over there. Don't ask, don't tell. <laughs> Which so, is mostly don't. <laughs> so I'm going to post some things in the Skype chat real quick while you guys talk. Talk amongst Talking. yourselves. Go, I'll go. give you a topic. <laughs> Alright, give me a topic and we'll talk about it. Uh, I, I, I actually couldn't think of a topic. I was actually just... Wow, some topic. I <laughs> was actually just quoting... Uh, there's a Mike Myers sketch from Saturday Night Live. Coffee, uh... coffee talk. 
I oh, I'll tell you what uh, topic tonight. There uh, we go. That my, looks much better. My mother told me that uh, today's the day. Uh, back in 1969, uh, Sesame Street aired for the first time tonight. Did it? Hmm. Yeah. Really? Yeah, wow. Today's, uh, um, today's the that night. I don't know where that. And she was showing me uh, the famous uh, Menomina. Now, my absolute favorite thing Jim Henson did, and you have to it, it, you have to search for it because it's uh, the precursor to the Muppet Show. Right. Um, it's called the end of sex and violence on television. <laughs> okay. And it starts hmm. off with giant stone words saying sex and violence and Crazy Harry. And if you've watched The Muppet Show, you know Crazy Harry is the dude with the TNT plunger. Oh, yes. <laughs> he's still an icon in The Muppets. Oh, yeah. Like, he's, he's been Crazy around Harry is the best. Uh, but it's basically, it's The Muppet Show uh, being pitched. It's it's actually the pitch huh. for the, the for the Muppet Show done in character by the characters. Hmm. So we have a request from the chat box. We have a request oh, from the chatty box. Yes, uh, Shadowmeister was wondering if we could listen to his "Can't Wait" remix. Well, give me a second. I will see if I can't pull it up. Shadowmeister, can you throw a link at us? That that'll, that'll make it easier for everyone. It I'll, make it I'll post the link in the Skype chat. Oh, you've got it? I found it. Oh, you got it? I don't know. Oh, rock and roll. Okay. So. Cool. Uh, <sighs> Y'all get ready. I'm going to uh, I'm gonna get this queued up. Sesame Street Jack Black defines. Oh, yeah. That's for me. <laughs> Move this back over here. Okay, guys. I'm going to mute you and start the song in just a minute. This is Shadowmeister's remix of Can't Wait. We are not yet Elements of Harmony. We're just a bunch of guys. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we, are the, we are the opposite of your OC sucks. <laughs> the opposite? The yes. opposite. We're the opposite. That would explain the why they we're... kept swearing at us every time they ran into us at BronyCon. <laughs> I remember when Muff, uh, can we say this? All right. Uh, I remember when Mummified, when we were at BronyCon, he came uh, up to us. He's like, beep you guys, beep you guys, forget it. <laughs> was that Rick? Did you Rick roll me? I, I just heard it. I just heard that. That was not coming from me. Anyway, um, so yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, this, this, uh, I have one question, Shadow, before oh, I, uh, before I do this. I, you may have, have it in your description, but, uh, I have to know who did this cover art. Uh, uh, because I've got it full screen right now, so. Car uh, the art was by D. Nart. D. Nardi. D. E. A. N. N. A. R. T. Yeah, it's D. Nardi. Go. Awesome. Go it's I, I love it. It's ador It's super adorable. And rather than just talk about it, I'm gonna go ahead and mute you guys and pull it up and start playing. All right.
And we're back. In we? theory, but for some reason, Are my we? OBS is being weird. Hi, encoding. <laughs> oh, yours is doing that too, huh? Yeah. yeah. Outstanding. Uh, I mean, it shows that you can hear us, but for some reason, it's showing. Uh... There we go. Okay. <laughs> now it's showing All Skype right. again. Because All videos. Right. Biggest problem in the radio show. Yeah, well, we all have faces for radio, so. Yeah, well. Hey, speak for yourself. I don't even have a face for radio. <laughs> oh. oh God, I just closed, I just closed the tab and I saw the, the image for my video and, oh, my head hurts already. Oh um, goodness! So I may so just was... I may just put up the I may just put up the logo. <laughs> oh jeez! So that was oh, can't wait, uh, Shadow Meister's remix, dude. And it was a lot of fun, Shadow. It was it was That's poppy really... and bouncy and reminded me of early Daft Punk. Hmm. Mm -hmm. It also that had a very '80s synth to it. <laughs> Yeah, I, I just like the glitchiness in the within the drop of it. That's actually really good too. I, it's, it's actually surprising that he actually remixed this. It's pretty astounding. Fun fact: he actually sent that to me to master for him. So, that's the fun fact of the day. Really? Yep. Yay. You learned something. I was kind of quality control for that, and he did amazing on it. Dude. Yeah, this, it, uh, you know what makes me happy? Every time we come on here, I feel like we're just doing stupid things, but then I realize that fans are watching us, and they're making music for themselves, and <laughs> they're getting better. Mm -hmm. We're making a difference. This is great. No, <laughs> seriously. <Yes. laughs> Something, something, collab, collab, collab. <laughs> yeah. Collab, 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 collab. It's actually really amazing that we're make, actually making a difference. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I was actually apologizing for the chime sound that just popped up for everyone but you guys. <laughs> Thank you Sorry for ruining the moment. Yes. The moment is gone. Are you so Good sorry job. for making a difference? But, uh, yeah, everybody that just listened to uh, Shadow Miser's uh, remix, go hit that subscribe button to him because he only has 17, so I want him to see more and more subscribers now. Do it! Yeah, definitely, because I've heard what he's been working on and what he does. He's actually really good. He just doesn't give <laughs> that up. That wasn't even the mastered version. <laughs> <laughs> he uploaded oh, the wrong oh. file in the video. <laughs> 
well, here we go. It's good even well, without me. Well played. Oh, wow. <laughs> Just all right. Uh, <laughs> to the dignity. Too well, good job, Shadow. Well, <laughs> allow me to allow me to initiate the sarcastic clap. Yep. That's that's sarcastic. Th yes. If you saw it, you would understand. But <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's yeah, one of those that you look at the person driving in front of you whenever they cut you off, and you're just like, "Well done, sir." You know what? You know what? Here, let's add this too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, it is. Uh, uh, I love this soundboard. <laughs> you should have the Shia LaBeouf soundboard. Oh, no. 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 Oh, no. no. Yes. That does not exist. Do Please it. Please don't. Just oh. I'm gonna do it. it. Right. I'm searching for it now. Real Why well. did you give him this idea? Uh, <laughs> so... Uh, Flatness, oh, is there something God. you wanted to share with us? Because I'm being told to check a uh, to check a Skype group. Oh no, it was just me being annoying about talking, because I'm really really bored. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were going to be able I'm to make sitting... it tonight. Yeah, well, I realized I'm sitting at a desk with nobody in the building. Oh. So yeah, and I realized that way too late. Yeah. You know what that means, right? Mm. Play soccer oh, in the halls. God, I can't get it. <laughs> no. Actually, oh, don't play soccer. I will be sliding on the hallways because extra duty yes. has to wax, wax and buff the floors. Oh, even better. Get like a, like a giant slab of cardboard and just like find a giant hill and go. <laughs> oh, no. I'm just going to like take off across the floor. <laughs> just like, okay, here I go. Whee! If I do I'll it, I'm going to twitter it. I have a very important uh, question for you, Flightless. Oh, God, what? It, ha it has to do with boot camp. Oh, wonderful. And floor buffers. <laughs> tell me you never... Tell me you never tried to ride a floor buffer. I will neither confirm nor deny this. <laughs> <laughs> and what's bad is... I tried to do that before I joined. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but then you got this oh. big open space. You move all the bunks oh, no, aside. <laughs> no, see, that's when we took for being a cat. Yes, that's when I, I took. That's when we took. What? Oh, I was about to say I hate to admit that I've actually tried that as well. Oh, yeah, everybody! Everybody who's had access to a large, large waxed floor and a floor buffer. Has done has that been. and has done the risky business slide. Yep. Grab <laughs> 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 all the extra mattresses, start lay them on the floor, and everyone would start running and dive on them and go head first into each other. <laughs> Mattress jousting. Oh. Uh, oh no! Mattresses would like. Bend up, so we would just kind of go flying off to the side. It was a, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> the other the other fun thing um, tonight on America's Funniest Home Videos. Aww. We uh, as soon as as soon as you find out about the acoustics in the uh, in the bathroom, and you've got a bunch of guys, suddenly you've got like a barber shop octet. <laughs> okay. I don't know how PG-13 this is going to be, but sing-alongs in the shower build camaraderie. They do. That's all I... If, if somebody says, let's get down to business, everybody better start singing Mulan. Two defeat. <laughs> that wouldn't have even been the first thing that came to my mind if you said that. So. <laughs> and that's why you're... The dark side of the moon. The moon. <laughs> okay, Father Mord has a suggestion, but I don't know if, like, given that particular question, I'm not sure that the answer is going to be PG-13. Depends on the question. Uh, basic training. What's the best used for hand sanitizer? Oh, staying awake. Huh. Oh. Really? You're falling asleep? Just take a big whiff of. Oh yeah, no, that'll work. <laughs> oh, you'll wake that right up. Really? Work. <laughs> um, 
All right, I need to rearrange things just a little bit. Let me try this. Yeah, so if you're ever bored, if you're ever stuck in a meeting, or just really trying to stay awake, take a big old whip of hand sanitizer. Let me try this, because I have hand sanitizer. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I regret it. You regret it, but you're awake, aren't you? Anyway, wow. it is now. Where do, I, where do I get the feeling that like kids are gonna turn this into like the next lead paint issue or oh, something? Oh no! <laughs> no! That's no! Funny you oh, mentioned that. It's it's now after uh, nine o'clock central, ten o'clock eastern. So we should probably move on to uh, to our show. <coughs> Indeed. Yeah, it sounds like a good plan. All right, plan. this is where I take the Pink Panther's advice and exit stage right. Uh, that's not the Pink Panther. That's Snagglepuss. That's Snagglepuss. <laughs> <not> correct, no. <laughs> Only 21. Excellent. Stage right. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah. Uh, well, thanks for joining uh, us, Flight List, for a couple minutes. Enjoy your boredom. Yeah, thank you for having me and solving Use. a little bit of my boredom. <laughs> Use hand sanitizer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Way too much. <laughs> But he's hung on a D bat. I uh, know on a nine volt battery. Oh. <laughs> don't actually do that. Um, uh, actually, that's a really good idea. Canterlot Hill does not encourage doing anything of the sort. That was Canterlot Hill does not encourage doing anything. Let's be honest. We're <laughs> <That's, laughs> awful people. Do not answer. listen to <laughs> us. <laughs> that is. We, we, we come from a generation where we just did things. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't let our dreams be dreams. <laughs> 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 God, now nice. it feels like we're the generation of Shiloh Club. Everybody, Great. get your get your intro doc up. <laughs> yep. uh, well, thanks for having me, guys, and have right. a great show. Thanks, See you, man. Yeah. Later. All right, have a good one. Ready? Mm-hmm. Hi, yeah, this good. is Parchment Scroll, Snowblitz, Steel Cords, Rock and Brony, and Dice. This is. Not playing. There we go. On the show, we finally talk about Friendship Game. We've covered the first two Equestria Girls movies as they brought us new music, and the third installment is no different. This time, the movie brought us nearly a dozen new songs, and in no time at all, the fandom has remixed them in, a man in all manner of ways. Join us as we take a listen to some of these remixes here tonight. Yes, indeed. Welcome yes, to the indeed. show. Yes, indeed. And our video is doing the Frozen thing again. Yeah, so I was going to tell, was our, gonna tell our you video that. recording has been stuck on or actually our video itself has been stuck on that uh, that uh, one shot from the very beginning of the intro but you know I've been having trouble with OBS as well there we go and now we're back to us okay so that's it I'm gonna have to edit this video before sending it along the dice sounds good so Ooh, good. extra work Yay, extra work. But it's it's a labor of love. It is. Uh, if you say so. It it helps us sleep at night. <laughs> <laughs> we, yeah. already, we already found out what helps you not sleep at night. So. <laughs> that is true. But yeah, so tonight we're going to be talking about different songs from Friendship Games. 
Now, in the past, we've done actual soundtrack discussions, and in the interest of just being that much more embracing of the Brony community and not at all towing the line of C&D, we're going to be only sticking to the remixes. Because we don't want to go after the overlords of Hasbro. Not at all. No. And as you pointed out earlier, Steel, this actually was a pretty tough thing to find because there aren't a lot of remixes. Of Everybody this. was so hyped yeah. for that for that CMC episode. They were too busy remixing songs from that. <laughs> Yeah, I swear to you, like going through EQD, like for every mu like every different video that they put up there for any new musician, there's like at least three different remixes of one of the songs from that episode. Mm -hmm. Like it is insane how much people latched on to that episode. Yeah, I don't yeah. know why it's like. I, I mean, I can understand why it's getting attention, but it, at the same time, it's just like it was a decent episode, but it was not like the best episode. Mm -hmm. It's yeah, being I'll... very over glorified, in my opinion, but I'm not going to go there. A lot of well, the thing is, I think part of it is a lot of people have their head cannons, and they really, really like the idea of redeemed villains. And I am, I have no problem with redeemed villains. I love redeemed villains myself. But redeeming a villain in an episode is going to make for a huge fan reaction. Mm -hmm. True. Yeah. That is good. Though I don't think they had too much of a huge reaction. I may be mistaken, but I don't think they had that huge a reaction when they redeemed Gilda. They did. Oh, you should have seen. The thing is, the reaction there was over on Fim Fiction. Mm. Oh, uh. yeah, that that explains it. I stopped going to Fim Fiction a while ago. Uh, see, if Flightless is here, he would confirm that because Flightless is uh, is also a fic reader. <clears throat> okay. So, so, but yeah, no. Um, friendship games. Friendship games. Great songs in friendship games. I'm a little upset that I couldn't find a remix of my favorite song from friendship games. That that actually bugged me. What was your favorite song? Akadeka. Mmm. Yes. Uh, all right. Oh no. I honestly don't remember a whole lot from the movie, considering I only watched it once. <laughs> Yeah, That's I watched fair. it. I watched it uh, with Parchi on this. Yeah, on Snow, Snow and I watched it in a Skype call. It was, yeah, it was like it was a good. It was a good movie. I felt like you know they have completely encapsulated, wrapped up Sunset Shimmer's story arc from beginning to mm -hmm. end as a parallel of uh, Twilight's, and having her take the role that Twilight took at the end of the first movie, uh, at the end of the third movie, um, made for you know a great you know wrap up. So. Despite the fact that they're working on a fourth one, they can stop at any time now because it's done. <laughs> they can. Yeah. And real quick aside, for all of you following along at home or watching this in the future, there will be plenty of spoilers in this video. If you haven't seen the movie, sorry, not sorry. Yeah. Uh, if no, you haven't seen the movie, weeks. if you <laughs> haven't seen the movie, it's been over a month already. So get out from under your rock. Well, some people haven't seen Star Wars yet, so your point is invalid. <laughs> that is true. Wow, I was watching a this. cracked video today where they were comparing Star Wars to uh, Hunger Games. No, please, no, oh, please don't. God. Please don't. No. no. And, please, and no. Th two thirds of the way through the video, one of the one of the characters is like, "Wow, spoilers!" It's like, "Well, you know." Uh, Hunger Games has been... No, 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 no. I mean, for Star Wars. Yeah, well, I'm not sorry at all at this point. <laughs> Hunger Games shouldn't even be a spoiler if you read the books before the Yeah, movies. well... Yeah. Well, uh, that goes for any franchise. Seriously, even Star if Wars... If the books exist... <laughs> but then you might have an incident like you have with George R.R. R. Martin, who starts <laughs> reading the way things go, just to mess with the people who are all, well, I read the book first, and the ba -da -ba -da happens. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, but, uh... Speaking, well, you know what? speaking of George R. R. Martin and fantasy, let's awkwardly segue into the first song. 
<laughs> can you, since you're editing this, can you just edit ed, like edit in a seg our Segway pony? Oh wow, <laughs> I forgot about that Segway pony. <laughs> since you're editing it, just 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 let it cruise around for a while. Is it really Bopper or something? <laughs> I, so I, the, I think I of... think it was just a, a straight up Google image search result. <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> like uh, I just, I just went on. You know what? Let's see if I can't find it before before we go to the mo the, the actual song. Let's see if I can't find Segway Pony. Uh it's Lyra yeah, yeah. on a Segway. Why does that not surprise me? Like seriously, there it is. Oh, great. Now it's going to take forever. There it is. High encoding, but there's Lyra on a Segway right there. <laughs> of all the ponies on a Segway, yeah, that makes sense. My life is complete. <laughs> oh, wow. Here's one, here's one of an, a very angular cadence. On a Segway. Angular? Yeah, I like the art style. Huh. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah. So, <laughs> but they meant like she doesn't make like pixels or something. No, 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 no. Just a very, very. I love the art style. Actually, I gotta find out who that is. <laughs> All right, let's go to the first song break before. We All right. Go. So, first song here. Um, and I apologize for the video. I apologize right now for this video. Having it, I've got a dual monitor set up right now, and um. So out of the corner of my eye, it feels like it's strobing. Um, so I do want to apologize ahead of time for the visual effect in this video. Uh, if it gets too bad, I will switch over to the Candlelight Hill logo. <laughs> You've no, been that is warned. a nice art style. Yeah. Oh. Um, <laughs> you have been warned. Um, but uh, this is... Uh, Psychoacoustics remix of Unleash the Magic from the Friendship Game soundtrack. You're listening to it on Canterlot Hill, on the hill, from the mountain. On Elements of Harmony, I forgot that part. Way to go me. <laughs> <laughs> on the hill, from the mountain, by the pool, somewhere in Beijing. I'm going to mute their clapping now. Here we go. Welcome back. I am so sorry. 
I am so sorry. Like, I loved the remix, but oh my god. <laughs> and even after I switched over to the logo, um, I still had to have the video up so I could see how much time was left. And so, mm -hmm. while you guys, and by you guys, I mean the people on the stream, um, got the, uh, the, uh, just the, the CLH logo, I still had that strobing, throbbing glasses over that background. Mm. And, yeah, that, yeah. That, that, that makes sense. <laughs> The glitching, the, the glitching yeah. where it was, that was, that was just my computer going, I don't have enough memory, so you don't get the full animation. Oh, that wasn't just because of the, just because of the, like, the streaming video. I mean, just, like, the video itself, like, it's just very unsettling to the eyes. The, oh, yeah, the video is very unsettling to the eyes. I don't know if it was deliberate, like, because the song, the song is an unsettling moment in the movie, and that's, mm -hmm. a, that remix, like, adds to the darkness a bit by making it a little bit more aggressive. And, uh, yeah. It does, and I'm not sure that's the the feeling I get from it. I think it was trying to make it a little more, I don't know, mind awesome. screwy. Mind screwy. Oh, awesome oh, works. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. It. Yeah, I liked it, but it's just not like, like sinister. No, it just seems like very like, uh, uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? Like, kind of like evil carnival kind of style I guess to it <laughs> yeah no um like <laughs> I right. liked the mix um there was yeah um <coughs> the really new mop is right in that it does have uh the actual instrumental of the song in still buried in it um but it's not too off putting that it's there mm -hmm. and it was <clears throat> It, I I I like I enjoyed the remix. It's one of the better like when when uh, in the intro, Dice you wrote and made me say uh, that there was like thirteen or twelve or thirteen songs, but some of a good chunk of those songs are, that are on the soundtrack were released mm -hmm. in the interim between the second and third movies. Well, three were. There were three songs, and they were. Uh, what was it? My past is not, not today. today. Right. Um, Life is a runway okay. and friendship through the through ages. Through the ages, yeah. And then there's also that was a good one. There's also songs that were on the soundtrack that were that were released after the movie, uh, like Dance Magic. Mm -hmm. um, Which so good. Oh, yeah. We'll cover that later. <laughs> didn't hear this one. You didn't hear Dance Magic. Nope. You will. I have not heard that one either. Okay, then. <laughs> it's it's a it's a fun one, but it is it is a fun fun song. We're jumping I ahead. I don't remember a lot of these songs. <laughs> <laughs> well, for some some of them were promotional materials, like the three that yeah. came out before. Oh yeah, those three. The Hasbro uh, animation shorts. Those... <clears throat> mm -hmm. Yeah, they're little. I, I saw those beforehand, and honestly, I don't really remember those either. But. <sighs> Yeah, but that's just... I'm losing my memory. I'm too young to be losing my memory. What is wrong with me? Who are you? Where are we? I don't know. Where's the Who tapioca? Donde esta el queso? Raisins? <laughs> Who am I? What's my name? <laughs> do you know my name? Stop. The biblioteca. <laughs> do, you my, do you know my name? Because someone told me my name was John Cena. Uh, <gasps> oh. We went full Cena. Yes. Da, 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 da. So... Getting back to... We're going to have to get used to this, I get the feeling. Getting back <laughs> yes. to the music. Um... <laughs> Sorry. All so, right, back to the music. Speaking of that. things to apologize for, Snow, it's time for your pick. Oh, it's mine? Great. Oh, oh my I... god, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Rock and Brony. I was like, what? there's a link in here. What is this link in here? <laughs> I don't have this one in my tabs. So I apologize to the listeners who got a half second of Rick Astley. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, 
I'm gonna give you. It's just like with the, it's just like the Brony Cone panel. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. If you guys haven't seen that, it's on YouTube now. It is. What? Our, our panel, panel from this past year. I saw it. And it was, was better than I remembered it being. Was it actually good? Yeah. Yeah. I think I, I, I still try to forget about it. I don't even watch our stuff. <laughs> Yeah, Winchester, that was uh, a half second of Rick Roll thanks to Rock and Brony. <laughs> Rick Roll. You are welcome. <laughs> <laughs> but, moving right along, Snow. Yo. Let us talk about oh, your my choice. Uh, my choice was, uh, let me remember what I chose last week. <sighs> it's in the doc. Yeah, I know it's in the doc, but I don't remember what song it was. It's oh. the one by your name. What is this? Yes, I know. Uh, it's from the song. <laughs> Alright, it's a Arch. remix of uh, the song What More Is Out There. Uh, and the person that remixed this is by Strigaday. Strigaday? Sounds, Sounds about I'm gonna right, call, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call you Strigaday. Yeah. So, this is uh, what, what More Is Out There remix by Strigaday. You're listening to Elements of Harmony on Carantalot Hill from the mountain. I've walked through all these halls before I've been in and out of every door Whoa. There's nothing in this school that I don't know In every class my grade's the best The highest score on every test I guess that means it's time for me to go I know there's more that's out there and I just haven't found it yet I know there's more that's out there Than other me I haven't met Welcome back, guys. Hey. 
it's, it's a... So I've, I've mentioned this over the song break, and I, w- I was wondering if you guys would agree. Stop. If you... Stop beeping. <laughs> 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 like, I unmute myself, and then I realize it's not going to stop. <laughs> uh... <laughs> that was the countdown timer for, for, uh, for the song. Like that, I synced up with the song, and then the song ended before that, and then the thing, the countdown timer still had thirty seconds left to go when the the video ended. And I... <laughs> anyway, continue. What were you saying? I was saying is that I mentioned this over the song break, but if you listen to, I say, was it Strigaday that was doing the vocals in this that this says? I believe so. Yeah. Yeah, I was thinking of, like when I was listening to it, if you. Think about it. It kind of sounds like if you know the lead singer of the band Creed, uh, if you don't know who they are, they did the song um, with arms wide open. If you listen to it, if you raise the pitch of the lead singer's voice from Creed, it almost kind of sounds like Strigaday's voice in this. Yeah. It really does. It has that raspy t- sound to it, the quality that kind of like thrown back a thing of scotch <laughs> thing of scotch yeah. you know so if he had like a just if you want that voice you just drink a shot of scotch and then just suck on a helium balloon and there you go I mean I think there's more to it than that. <laughs> yeah somebody uh, got a sneak or the, our listeners got a sneak preview of uh <clears throat> Of one of our picks. Okay. Oh yeah, that's fine. Just just a split second of it. <laughs> we are so good at this teasing thing, but yeah. back to the song. Sneak previews. Okay, so around the middle of the song, it seemed like it kind of did this weird vinyl scratch drop, and I don't mean like the character. I mean. Yeah, like no. Like, for a sec. There was a well. Somebody was asking if there was a vinyl hiss sound, and like, yeah, there definitely was a a very slight vinyl hiss. Um. But, uh, yeah, no, I, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah. Uh, Winchester also said that uh, the person sounds like singing with braces for the first time. I don't know if there, I there, there was got there was to... something uh, muffled about the about the vocals. Yeah. Like not muffled uh, in 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 editing, but like muffled, like there was something in or over their mouth. Uh, it could add something to do. They were maybe a little close to the pop filter. That's what I'm thinking. Probably. Yeah. Because you're usually supposed to have like a distance between you and the pop filter and the mic. Yeah. Like if you see videos of people recording in studios and they've like they're really close to the pop filter and that's usually just for the video yeah that's no. not that's not how they actually record yeah that's usually for comedy sometimes yeah, yeah. just yeah. for dramatic effect i turn away from the mic to inhale <laughs> but uh i turn away just... from the mic to breathe <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the song is pretty nice. I like it. The vocals tend to need a little bit more work, but other than that, it's pretty decent. Yeah, SA has got a decent amount of potential. Yeah. It was pretty smooth. It was very <laughs> smooth. And I thought it was a neat take. It, it diverged greatly from the original song in the movie, which is a lot more builds up and is very kind of pseudo-empowering. This was much more muted. It felt very low key. Does that make sense? Yeah, that's, that's, I, I see what you're saying. My my, my first really thought low-key. is okie dokie Loki. <laughs> also, this is Jer's wonderful uh, contribution to the bass fl- play, bass player mini fridge uh, debate. Oh uh, yeah, I see. <laughs> the bass player hey, mini sleep- fridge. A bass playing a mini fridge. A bass playing a mini fridge. <laughs> it says well, actually it says it's a bass playing mini fridge, but I uh, choose to yeah. interpret it as a bass playing mini fridge. A bass like the fish. 
No, it is. No, uh, bass <laughs> as in the guitar. Oh, I see. No, that would be bass. In fact, <laughs> that is the exact here. same uh, bass that I used almost every episode when we needed a when somebody made a reference to a bass without describing exactly what type of bass. That is the exact image I use. <laughs> Interesting. Honestly, the way it it almost looks like it's a magnet on the mini fridge. It does look. Yeah. Like it does. It looks like a little magnet. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um. I feel like one day. But even in the fridge, I'd rather have a bass player. Regardless. I have of a feeling. Horribly <laughs> off-topicness, though. Um. Yeah. <laughs> the the song that we we just listened to. Yeah. Um. Definitely great voice and pitch control, but yeah, too close to the pop filter or or take the lemon wedge out of your mouth or whatever it is. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, it was, you know, a Strigiday or Strigiday or however, however it's pronounced has a wonderful voice. I just wish it had been clearer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Definitely. They do have a lot of potential in what they're doing, so I'm looking forward to what they got. That's what I like in remixes and covers. Like it's not entirely like the original songs. Like it's it's it doesn't sound the same at all. Or else it's just you know speeding up the song or just adding some drums and that's kind of boring. I guess. Yeah, that's not that's not a remix. That's like <laughs> you know here's yeah, the yeah, nightcore yeah, yeah, remix of Discord. <laughs> <laughs> No, oh, you you guys call it nightcore. Back in my day, we called it putting a thirty three on forty five. No, back in my day, we called it. Back in my day, we called it chipmunk remix. That's oh, new, Alvin and Chipmunks. It's a good day, two thousand one. The music of Dave Seville. Mm-hmm. <laughs> good golly. So, steel. Yeah. You're up next. Oh, oh, right. Um, <laughs> so, just to be clear, uh, I was kind of brought in last minute, so I didn't really get to choose this. I just kind of borrowed this song in particular. But, uh, yeah, uh, this is, I'm, I'm assuming it's good because it's Violet Pony, but it's a remix of My Past Is Not Today featuring Strigaday again. Uh, Violet Pony Remix. So, yeah, I guess if you want to cue that up. Um, it's, it's queued up, it's just waiting on you. Okay, good. So, this is My Past Is Not Today, Violet Pony Remix, featuring Striga Day. You're watching Elements of Harmony on Kennerlot Hill.
Welcome yeah, back. Thanks. So. I'm willing to go fix this timer. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. So unfortunately, OBS was and is still showing the uh, the video, even though the video is actually that tab is gone now. The video is gone. But as far and OBS should be on Skype, but it's it's not doing it. It'll catch up. It'll catch up. It'll, there it is. Okay. All right. The little video that could. The little mm -hmm. video that could, yeah. Um, so that was my past is not today, Violet Pony remix. <laughs> yeah, my wife walked in while the song was playing. She was like, "What the heck is that?" Because <laughs> that video was uh, like she couldn't hear the music. All she just saw was the video. And for those of you, like, if you took my advice in the chat and went over to the YouTube video to uh, to see what it actually looks like you'd see why she said that it's like it's like all the stuff like if you ever if you ever saw a movie in the 90s where they go into a rave club and they have the videos playing on the walls and it's all blade. just random glitchy imagery reminds me of blade blade that's a good one i was thinking uh the uh the club from hackers actually oh also that <laughs> i guess but uh definitely a uh interesting video for a great remix uh the the vocals were a lot clearer on this one so yeah i think mm -hmm. the the problem with the other one was was mic placement and Strigida is learning <laughs> yes indeed although i i think I, we all accept and know the fact that no one here knows anything about edm <laughs> not at all it's it's oh. I'm pretty sure in our bylaws that we can't have someone who knows anything about EDM longer than ten minutes. Oh that's why Flightless was only here for pre show. Yep. Well, you know, I do like okay. I haven't made I've made two absolutely awful EDM songs that are, one of which isn't even finished. Um but I do like know some about EDM. So I want to take exception to that. I just, there are so okay. many genres. I hesitate to say what genre that was supposed to be. <laughs> because I will be wrong. And somebody out there will be like, no, it's clearly this. Because this, 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 and this. Like, <laughs> I want to say glitch, but the vocals weren't glitched. Um... But there's definitely an aspect of glitch to the uh, to the uh, to the actual mix, you know. Anybody else want to actually like jump <laughs> no, in on, on this conversation? <laughs> you're on a roll. Go ahead. <laughs> um, I absolutely loved the. Uh, Oh, man. See, I've lost it. I had it, and then, like, all the terminology was like, Haha, remember when you used to use me? <laughs> you haven't, so I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> oh. um, but, 
to the, the there's there's a point like where the audio just all syncs up with with uh, with the uh, LFO, and so it fades and hits notes at the right at, at exactly the right time. It's really really well executed. Um, I absolutely loved that part. The part just hit hard, and I loved it. Well, speaking as one who truly does not know much about EDM, it was a lot of fun to listen to. I definitely could hear what you were talking about with the glitch elements. And it sounded very samplery near the end there. And what I mean by that is it a lot of different like one-shot sounds as opposed to more repetitive sounds. At least it felt like. Uh, I think I know what you mean. <laughs> Um, and I, I, I can get, I, I can get that, yeah. Um, it was definitely, uh, definitely an interesting choice in how to remix it, like, to keep the, the, uh, the actual vocals completely unmolested, mm -hmm. but absolutely, I don't want to say mangle, but just completely go to town on the actual uh, on, on the background music and the uh, music itself mm -hmm. oh my yeah. god it's so silent <laughs> it is, it's so quiet um, mm -hmm. I think the only possible solution here is if uh, if somebody was to jump in and, uh, and I don't know, maybe introduce the next song might as well jump <laughs> Go ahead and jump. That's actually a good one I can get behind. Go that. ahead, jump. Van Halen is awesome, so yeah. All right, so I guess it's my turn. It is. It is. Unfortunately, we cannot uh, broadcast a whole um, Never Gonna Give You Up video. Yeah, unfortunately. no. Um, <laughs> I, I've already, we've already played as much of that song as we're going to play. <laughs> <laughs> And but that yeah, was, again... doo -doo, and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's why you heard it in the pre-show because yeah. I was googling it. And yeah, again, my choice is the same um, as um, Steel did, which I googled Friendship Games remix, then <laughs> found uh, this one, which is uh, again another remix of Unleash the Magic. Yeah, but which was time... not Steel. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> totally sorry. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. Um, but yeah, it's uh, Unleash the Magic... Uh, uh, Mashi. Mashi. Unleash Mashi. the Magic remix by uh, Swag Baroni. So you're listening to Elements of Harmony on Candidate Hill. And we're listening to Unleash the Magic remix by Swag Baroni.
And we're back. All right. And that was Unleash the Magic Remix by Swag Brony. So hey, I might as well jump in since, but... since this was my pick. Mm -hmm. I might as well jump in. I'm assuming that this was jazz. Because... <laughs> <laughs> totally that was totally yeah, yeah. uh yeah. that was so, actually specifically big band no <laughs> yeah, big band. You, you can see my jazz you cannot see my jazz hands right now but they're so jazzy oh my god <laughs> wow such jazz no but uh, um uh, according to my edm knowledge this was trap music am i right because uh, I have no clue. I honestly don't know, but that sounds right. <laughs> <laughs> sure. I'm so great. You're, yeah, let's let's go with that. Since none go, of it's, it's trap music, it is trap music. You cannot uh, change my choice. It is trap music. We will go with that until we are corrected. Yeah. Now, is that your oh, final answer? Lord. Yes, this is my final answer. Great. All right. And. <laughs> And we'll see if it's the right answer after the break. We get a break? Oh, uh, wow. Just, okay, so I'm I just... just told OBS to completely get rid of the uh, the view of the video. Like, it's it's no longer in my list of scenes, and it's still showing it. Weird. I may have to stop and restart the stream for just a second to clear this up. Oh, there we're back. Okay. Okay. <laughs> We're back! Yay! We're back! Yay! Yay. Now, I told thing... Joe was going to be back. <laughs> I thought it was really neat how, compared to the other song, or other remix of this song, this one, it did a lot of what our last song did, which was it left the vocals mostly alone and really went to town on the background music. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we had a lot of that almost like drumline sound of. Yeah. What is the term for that in EDM? Drumline. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, no, that's seriously. There's, there's, it's, it's, it's the term. Okay. Yeah. No. I mean, like. A lot of EDM know. falls under the overall category of D and B, drum and bass, and this definitely does. Um, a lot of the snare. Yeah, drum. Uh, um, <laughs> I don't know. It's EDM. I don't. I'm not knowledgeable with that. Come to talk with you again. Is so silent no, in here. Yeah, yeah no, no, I'm sorry. Fine. I'm actually trying to set up because I can't do the video thing like I thought I was going to be able to, so I'm trying to set up something else instead. Gotcha. Uh, welcome to Elements, and we have no idea what we're talking about. Well, <laughs> even so, the song did play a little bit with the vocals, a lot, a lot like we saw in early Br Brony Dumb, where playing around with the vocals and changing them up like with all the fluttershies a vast fluttershy yeah uh, okay. so we had <laughs> elements of that crop up again but definitely felt like it was focused more on this the background beat element here definitely. Yeah. <laughs> well and Q7 and Garfunkel. Um, all in all, it sounds really good. The, just like the remix of it. And I like how they left the, the vocals on the Yeah, no, and I loved the I loved that they chose the genre to match the vocals instead of trying to force it to fit a new uh a new style. Mm -hmm. I think we're getting pretty close to the end of the hour, and it's sounding like we're feeling pretty close to the end of the hour. Yeah, we are very close to the end of the hour. Um, I think keep, we should keep, go out on the next song. Keep filling time uh, away. Sounds uh, like a good okay. idea. Well. 
Okay. The next all right. Now, all right. Now we're ready now. <laughs> all right. So. So why don't we? Actually, before, the next... because before we introduce the next time, we're getting really close to the top of the hour, so we should probably do our uh, do it as our as our uh, as our closing credits sort of thing. Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm thinking. So <laughs> before we do that, though, I do want to remind everybody: uh, upcoming on Canterlot Hill, uh, Fridays at 2 p.m. Eastern Time, we have Luna Beats. And at 8 p.m., we have Elemental Sounds. On Saturdays at 2 p.m., we have Lycandee's Beats. And at 6 p.m., Mixology. And, of course, the ever-present More. <laughs> so, all of those times are in Eastern Standard Time. You can find out more at canterlothill.com. May I say something before we leave? You certainly may. Thank you, sir. Um... Remember last year I was supposed to go to BronyCon, but unfortunately I couldn't. Mm-hmm. Right. Well, I'm announcing that I'm going this year. <gasps> wow. Du, 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 du. Yay. Congratulations. Yay. So everybody go to BronyCon 2016 to, to see Rock and Brony, and I don't know. Yeah, right now I'm talking. I'm, I'm currently dis- <laughs> discussing with um, uh, Cyril the Wolf to see if we could, you know. Ooh. Bony Palooza and stuff. That like <laughs> but yeah, that, that's in the future. That's in the future. Don't talk about it. <laughs> you didn't hear it here first, folks. I'm probably going to try to do a metal version of John Cena's theme or something. I don't know. Oh, that could be. Because <laughs> yeah. apparently last year, like, everyone was screaming, just do within John Cena. I, I was not there, so I cannot confirm. Uh... I don't know about the uh, John Cena. I honestly don't know about the John Cena thing, but yeah, there uh, was a John whole Cena, lot of just, just do it. Uh, <laughs> and don't let your dreams be dreams. Oh, John Cena it will be. John Cena it will be. I hate yeah. that so much. <laughs> you will hate me. No, I All right. hate <laughs> But uh, with All that, right. let's uh, introduce the song and head out on our outro. Okay, so first of all, Dice, would you care to tell us about this song? Absolutely. So remember at the beginning of the show when I mentioned how dance magic is so good? Yeah. You're about you're about to experience it because this is Dance Magic Royal Pony House Hard Style Remix by Royal Pony 5300. And you're listening on Elements of Harmony on Canterlot Hill, on the mountain, near the pool, in Hawaii, not Beijing. <laughs> not Beijing. <laughs> <clears throat> Briefly, Rock and Brony, Steel, guys, yeah. despite mm-hmm. all of our talk before about not knowing genres, I think we can say we know what genre this next song is. Yes. Oh, really? <laughs> House art style. House hard style. Yes. Yes. This is the... folk song. Folk, yes. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Little smooth jazz, yes. In, in, in the meantime, <laughs> this has been... Snowblitz. Dice, Steel Chords, Rock and Brony, and Parchment Scroll. Thank you for tuning in to Elements of Harmony, and good night.
magic.